dad bod? <laughs> what, what goes through my head? I don't know. I mean, you know, I think I look all right. If you had all the guys I graduated with in here, I'd, I'd be really hot. I think the best shape of my life was when I was at conservatory and I was, take, I was doing a lot of ballet. That was intense. I was in really good shape then. But I've been on and off, you know, through life. You know, you have little kids and it's, it, for me, it went away for a little bit. Thank God for shirts. That's all I gotta say. In that period, you're like, I'm gonna get a shirt and keep it on all the time. Now I work out a lot just to to look normal. <laughs> I'm always outside, always. I'm antsy. I have to be doing something at all times. I'm a runner and I live on a farm, so I'm outside doing stuff all day. And, and that keeps me in shape, I think. But I, I, I love to run and it's a kind of therapy for me. But it gets harder when you get older, it really does. It, it, it's, you know, working out and all that is, and with kids and all that, you know, it, you, your responsibilities are different and, and your focus is different. And, you know, I remember when I was driving my kids around after school, that's all I did. I was just, a, I was a, a, a driver, that's it, right? You know, I drove them around in my truck and I had all my stuff and I had things to work on and, and I would take Audrey to dance and then take Henry to lacrosse and while he was at lacrosse I would like change in the truck and I would go run and then I would take him home and then you know so it's just it's almost impossible to work out you know so I f you fit it in. I was always kind of an odd duck I guess I don't know. I had my group. Awkward phase, yeah, we're all, we're all in that. I mean, there's maybe like four people that didn't have one. Matthew McConaughey, um, <laughs> you, know, like, you know, some people were like, man, always, gosh. I try to explain this to my kids. I'm like, I don't think of myself ever any differently than I thought of myself when I was 23. You know what I mean? Like, I know I'm older, but I don't, I, it, it's not a part of my brain. Like, I don't, I don't think like that. So it's very strange to be older or to go like, ah, what's that? Yeah. <laughs> the, why? You know, and you start, I think in the 50s, you start getting panicky. You're like, my hand hurts. What, am I dying? And they're like, no, that's the beginning of arthritis. So you're good, don't worry about it. Like, oh, whoa, right. I trained at a conservatory and I was really, you know, a theater actor and I, and I spent a lot of time honing my skills and getting experience and then you feel like, you know, when I moved to New York, I was like, I'm ready, let's go, throw it at me. Confidence and, you know, over prepare and guess what, you know, and that's what I try to tell my kids. It's like over prepare, show up early and don't be a d No one cares what your last name is or what school you went to, kill it. Thank you.